Hello Opera Crowd and welcome to another episode with me Opera Victoria. For today's episode we are doing a Try Treat Snack Crate. As everybody knows I love Try Treats. It has been my favorite subscription when it comes to treats in a crate I guess. Subscription baits you don't know what you're gonna get but you do know that you're trying different snacks from around the world. I have no idea who I got today but I'm very much excited. Taiwan! Woo! Yeah! So let's go ahead and open this bad boy up. I'm very much excited to be trying some Taiwan snacks today. Let's just, let's just, oh my god. Apparently the wrapping doesn't want to see. Just, just, let's go! Can't beat me when you're a fighter. I am just going to pick the first thing that's right here. It is called potato crackers. That is what they look like according to the packaging. Smell, smells like Smells like Cheez-Its. Five second rule. I mean, they're not bad. What I like about them is that they're super light tasting. They're super light, they're super, they feel like they're airy. Nice bit of salty taste. Kind of like, not exactly like saltine crackers, but I like them. Like a nice, good salty snack. 10 out of 10. Okay, next on our list. Lonely God, they look like potato twists. And that is what the packaging looks like. They got a little weird little fairy guy right here. This is gonna be seaweed flavor. I actually do like seaweed. I know maybe not many of you like seaweed. Oh my God. Many of you might not like seaweed, but I actually do and I can't. Yeah. I was trying to refrain but using my teeth, but when in doubt. They look like these little twisty things and they look like they got like little green specks on them, which I assume that is what the seaweed is. Eh, they're not super flavorful, like you can kind of taste the seaweed. It's not an abundance of seaweed taste. You could definitely tell that it's there. They're actually not bad when it comes to the texture. You have to like seaweed flavored. Would you like some seaweed? No. Very light seaweed taste, not very abundant on the seaweed. I wouldn't say these are good. I mean, I would give it more like, maybe like a seven, six out of 10. Not very like something I would crave, but it's not something I would hate either. Okay, next on our list, we have, I have no idea what this is, but this is what it looks like. That is what it looks like. Oh, it's rice crackers. Okay, so that's what these are, the rice crackers. They smell like those Quakers, whatever things those are. And it tastes just like them, but but what I will say is that these have more of a salty taste to them, so I do like them a lot more than it comes to the Quakers ones. The Quakers ones are kind of kind of bland, not very flavorful. These actually give you a nice salty taste, and I like it a lot. I give Quakers like a like a three out of ten. These are like a six out seven, no seven, seven out of ten, because I like these a lot more. And they actually gave me quite a few packets of them too. I'll probably be munching these at work, so definitely. X on our list. They gave me about like three of these, four of these. Dear God. Popping candy. It's volcano. So let's see, green apple, green apple. They're all green apples. So there's not different flavors. Ooh, man. I could smell the apple in that. Oh, yeah. All right. Tastes like Pop Rocks. I accidentally swallowed a few. So there's like a couple that are like popping in my throat right now. I thought there was actually going to be some, some kind of spiciness to them. I guess they're called Volcano because I guess it erupts of candy and all this. And honestly, in my opinion, you can't go wrong with Pop Rocks. 8 out of 10. Yeah, not that special. It would have been kind of cool if they did them spicy and it was green apple. I think that would actually be a pretty cool thing because then I feel like then it lives up to its name, Volcano Candy. Last on our list, and they actually gave us Try Treats. I love you so much, I swear. They, they, you literally spend $13 a month. 13, only 13 smackaroons. All this stuff and they give you like extra stuff. Like here's a handful of coconut candy, three sets of rice cakes, five or for these volcano things. I mean, they're setting me up for like nice little snacks throughout the month that you just, they're supposed to be snacks. You know, just grab a snack every once in a while as you're hungry or something. For the prize and for what you get, you guys are amazing. Enough sap talk anyways. So they are coconut candies. I'm not a huge coconut fan. Ooh, that is very, there ain't nothing more beautiful than my face. There you go. Never been a coconut flavor fan. But yeah, I've never been in the coconut stuff. I don't know why, just especially shadings. I'm not a big fan of coconut shadings. Let me know in the comment section if you're a coconut person because I'm, me, I'm not really one. These I would eat though. They taste like those coconut cookies that you find. I know those are kind of like crispy toasted 
coconut cookies and it's coconut shavings toasted or something like that. Those I will eat because they are so amazing, so freaking good. If you hate those, shame on you. They are actually fantastic cookies. That's exactly what this candy tastes like is those cookies. Give this a 10 out of 10, more like an 11 out of 10. Just because I don't like coconut, it's making me like coconut. I'm always impressed when I hate something so much that I end up finding something that's so good and that I can tolerate. This brand of cookies right here, that's what it tastes like. Anyways, guys, that is actually going to be it for me for today. Thank you, everybody, who has stopped by this episode. If you like this episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. I try to go for 10 likes per episode. When I hit that goal, thank you guys so much for helping me towards that goal. If you are not part of the Awkward Crowd yet and you yourself want to be part of the Awkward Crowd, if you are on YouTube, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And once you do, welcome to the Awkward Crowd. If you are watching this on Facebook, go ahead and hit that like or follow button. And once you do, again, welcome to the Awkward Crowd. You guys have a beautiful rest of the day and I'll see you guys in the next video. Anyways, my name is Awkward Victoria and I will see you guys later. Bye!